up? Welcome back to my channel. This is kind of going to be a bit of a quick review here because I don't have much time because I got to do something else. But I'm going to be reviewing this soap today. This is the Yes To Coconut Coconut Milk Bar Soap. I found this at Walmart for around $3.73 plus tax. I think it's available also at Walgreens, possibly CVS, and I haven't checked Target. If you guys know where this soap is available and anywhere else other than Walmart, leave it in the comments below and I'd like to check it. So I end up getting this soap from Walmart and as you can see, I still have this much left. It's a pretty big bar of soap. I believe it's around 7 to 8 ounces of soap. Oh, and by the way, if you happen to hear any singing over my talking, that's my mother in the bedroom. She's singing. She's listening to music right now. But anyway, I got this soap from Walmart. I've been using it for a minute and I gotta say I absolutely love this soap. It is a fantastic soap. It smells pretty much like coconut. It's like your generic coconut tropical kind of smell here. And as you can tell by the shape of this bar, it, it's much bigger than that. You get your money's worth for it. But I love the way that it lathers up because the lather from this is, it starts off bubbly and then it just melts away into this nice foamy, creamy kind of lather. The kind of lather that you would probably get if you were using, let's say, a cleansing conditioner or even a facial cleansing lotion of that matter. It's that good and it feels so wonderful on my skin. On the moisture, it does really good at moisturizing my skin, even in hard water. My trick is just bathe in warm to lukewarm water if you want the best results with this. On my face, same thing. It moisturizes as well as gets rid of all the excess oil and balances everything out. It's just really good. And I also use it for shaving too. It's great as a shaving soap too. You just have to use a lot more than necessary. My only cons for this would be mm, I don't really have a lot of cons except that I have to stop and I have to discontinue use of this soap because of um, two things that happen I guess well I can narrow it down to maybe one thing that's happened to me when I started using this soap I would say maybe three weeks after I started using it well the first three weeks everything was fine but as I started using it I noticed that little red bumps were starting to appear on my legs and then they started moving up to my arms now I'm not sure now, I kind of panicked for a bit because I wasn't sure if there was a particular ingredient in this soap that wasn't working well with my skin so I kind of switched it over over to um, much cooler water and used it and there was a bit of a reduction but the red bumps were still appearing on my legs because there's a bit of a rash on my chest that has not gone away for about two weeks. This is sort of a life update. I don't really like to inject a lot of stuff into this but because of those two things there, because of the rash and because of the little bumps that I've been having on my legs, I have to stop using the soap and I must switch to a more unscented soap. You know, like the soap I'm getting ready to review after this one. So just stay tuned for that. Otherwise, if I didn't have these problems, I would definitely buy this soap again. Five out of five flowers. It is a fantastic soap. It cleanses very well. It's the perfect balance of moisture and cleaning. It gets you thoroughly clean, but it moisturizes you at the same time, which is exactly what I'm looking for in a soap. So 5 out of 5 flowers, I just wish that my skin didn't act the way that it did. Otherwise, I would use the rest of this. But for now, I'm going to have to um, probably give it to my brother to use the rest of it. I think it would help him out. That's pretty much all I got to say about this soap. If you have any questions about this particular soap, let me know in the comments below and I will try to answer them as best as possible. And like I said at the beginning of the video, if you know any other places where this soap in particular is available other than Walmart, tell me in the comments below and tell me the price too. Because as soon as I get this all cleared up, as soon as I get this um, skin issue cleared up, I would be more than happy to get another bar of this soap again. It's one of my favorites now. So thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next video, okay? Bye guys!